Terry Nation and welcome back to the Hiram College Network. My name is Amber Thomas and I'm alongside head women's basketball coach Alex Dellis for the 2019 preseason interview. Feels good to be back coach. I know. I'm so happy. <laughs> it's been so long. <laughs> so you're heading into year three and I always see you on social media with your quotes and your mantras. So what quote or mantra are you bringing this season? Ooh. Um, you know, I can't say that we would say once, well, maybe the first one that we talked about, it was a, from Pat's summit. And she said, um, oh shoot, you know, defense wins games, but championships are won by rebounding. I don't know the exact quote, but um, so we, we've got to work on our rebounding and you know, our team, they're, they really want to win and they want to win big. And so that's something we're kind of living by right now. Crazy enough that you asked me that. So I was going to talk about your uh, senior to graduate, Erica Johnson. She was a rebounding machine. Mm -hmm. uh, who can we kind of see step into that role this season? Yeah, so um, Amanda Holtzman, she's a junior for us. Mm -hmm. She's a forward. So I really see yeah. her picking that up from there. Um, I see we brought in a couple first-year players, guards and forwards, that are looking to really cross the boards and box out and rebound. And then, um, of course, Cece Bright, she's a sophomore. She's... Mm -hmm. Um, in there and she can be fierce when she is in there boxing out just like a monster on the boards yeah so I always say that every time I see TT I just want to cue like <laughs> Alicia Keys that girl is on fire yeah last uh, year she became the first sophomore in Hiram history yeah. to win first team all NCAC arguably had one of the best single uh, best scoring performances in Hiram history um, we've been able to see her game mature from freshman year, which I really enjoyed. Uh, kind of what are you telling TT and what TT will we see once she gets to floor the season? Oh man, so TT, um, from everything she's told me, she was in the gym every day this yeah. summer. Um, just a few practices we've had already, she has been a force. And I think that she's just focused on being a great team player. Last, you know, as a first year, she learned a lot about herself. Last year, she was a great player, and now she's involving her teammates so much more with these amazing assists. And so it's super exciting. She'll still continue to do what she did last year, but she's going to bring that element of team in. Yeah. So, talking about the junior class a little bit, it's been quite interesting to see them go from freshman year also to now their junior year. They kind of still have that freshman spunk about them, but now like the upperclassmen poise. Mm -hmm. So what will we see from that group and who are some of the key people that we should be looking out for this season? Gosh, all of them. Yeah. <laughs> um, they bring so much experience already. Yeah. And, and even a couple of them that maybe were a little bit quiet, uh, freshman yeah. and sophomore year, someone like Michaela Baldwin, she is just blossomed I see her doing things on the court that I'm like whoa like <laughs> awesome so yeah. awesome so I see you know Mads is returning and Elena's returning and, and they're just doing great things as leaders and not just on the court and so I'm excited about that class they've they've really matured and grown up yeah so going to the other side your freshman class oh, I yes. saw six freshmen I got a little preview at hydration Olympics of the Splash Sisters. So mm -hmm. can you tell us a little bit about who they are and who the newcomers are? Yeah, so we have two players from out of state, mm -hmm. um, Alyssa and Haley coming from Connecticut, Maryland. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's something that I really work towards that we want, you know, diversity and culture on the team. We, we don't want to be just a bunch of Northeast Ohio basketball players. And yeah. so they bring, they were great high school players and now they're coming in to be great college players. And then um, what I call like our local players, yeah. At, uh, all the girls from Ohio, man, they came in and they just hit the ground running. Yeah. They, like, conditioning, weightlifting, our juniors are telling me they're they're beating their butts in that. And, okay. Um, they're making them level up. Um, yeah. So we're excited about the freshmen. They're all yeah. going to be doing big things. Yeah. So at the end of the season, you're sitting back and you'll say, this season was a success if. Ooh. This season was a success if we continue to lead in the conference in steals, yeah. free throw percentage, and we really increase our rebounding efforts. Yeah. Gotta get those free throws. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, Coach, for joining us. You can catch Coach and the rest of the women's basketball team all season long at HiramTerriers.com and on social media at Hiram underscore athletics. Until next time. See you later, Terry Nation.